Welcome to Someone Awesome Games. Good looking people, I'm Ron. We're playing Disney Infinity 3.0. We've got the little Finn here, FN2187, Stormtrooper McGee, chilling out on our Mock Jakku that we've got cranking. We're going to check out all of Finn's abilities, his skills, his crash his TIE Fighter. My poor man. You don't need that though. Let's jump into a skill tree and see what Finn can do. Is he any good? So, you've got mid-air recovery, of course, and athletic jump, so you can jump super high. Just like every character, I swear. I can, there's very few characters I can think that cannot do that. Uh, Finn's fender off, so blocking the incoming attack at close range with a well-timed press of E. And then we've got Stormtrooper's Strike, so Finn is a Stormtrooper. Uh, Finn attacks an enemy with Y with his weapon after repelling it. So if we use this one first, and then push Y, you'll uh, smack him in the face or something. We'll see. And then we've put some extra points into health and team revival. Not that I'd ever, I don't think I've ever used that. But I had some spare points left over. So I was like, I wanted this. And that would have wasted all the points I had. So I bought that. So you have no skill points left over. And now we're in the special here. We've got FN2187 training. Holding RB results in Finn planting himself and firing on a target. Flick the right stick while doing so to switch targets. This will continue as long as RB is held. So you will burn through your power things here. And then we've added some extra and special new readers. So we've got multiples. I think we have like seven. So you could have nine if you add this one as well. Quite a lot. Quite a lot. And we've got damage increase, meter upgrade. So that will... I bought this one. I was actually going to go this way. I was going to get this one and then and that one. Get some damage. But then I, I saw something a little bit later on. I was like, hmm, you know what? Meter upgrade would be good, the speedy meter upgrade. And that is in the, uh, in his ranged attack. I'll, ch I'll show you why I went with that one. Uh, we've got increased damage to be ca caused by Finn's combo attack. That's his basic attack. And then we've got breaking defense level one. You push Y, then you wait. And then you push Y again, and Y again. And then we've got one here, the air assault. So this is his only combo, and then this is his only air combo. So while in the air, delay the third tap of Y, then press RT to begin a powerful combo that slams an enemy into the ground before stunning them uh, with a blaster. So you do YY in the air, then you wait, then you do Y, then you do RT. So on the ground, this is only his only one, is Y, then you wait, and do two Ys. Then we've got his finisher. In a flash, Vin throws a flash detonator that stuns all targets in its range. Press X at the end of a combo when an opponent is hit. And then you can increase the time that they, uh, they're they stunned for. And then of course you've got damage increase for Finn's combos here. And then range attack. So we've got range attack, increases his blaster so he has a big stormtrooper gun. Uh, and then we've got here, boost of confidence. Defeating an enemy while shooting in aim mode will fill some of Finn's special move meter. So that's why I went with that speedy meter, just in case this makes it a little bit quicker. Now we've got blaster rate, so we've increased the rate the blaster fires, then damage, and then increase the rate again, so it fires really quickly. And we've got blaster shots, so we've increased the amount of shots we can shoot, and the damage. So we've basically put all the points into this side. And Finn is a super jumper, a tech specialist, and a marksman. So let's check out what he can do. So he's got this gun. I'm not sure if this is a stormtrooper rifle or one that Han Solo gives him, but it shoots very quick, as you can see. We've increased the blaster rate. Uh, it's also very silent. It has an initial sound, and it's pretty quiet, but it shoots a lot, and it's very quick. We'll find out how powerful it is. So let's check out Finn's combo. So his basic combo attack is this. And then I like to, if I do that, I like to finish it by holding Y, and then doing a little blast like that with his strong attack. And then we've got his basic attack combo, which is, I think, Y, and then blue weight, and we'll go like that. That's his only ground combo. Air combo, we do two attacks, wait, and then we do RT, and then it'll shoot someone to the ground. And then he's got little rolls, and dodges, and back flips, and front rolls. He does not have a lightsaber. I know the poster, trailers and stuff, you see him with a lightsaber. Not here. The only one who has a lightsaber in this game is Kylo Ren. Kylo Ren's the only Force Awakens character who's going to have a lightsaber. So, a bit of a bummer. But that's okay. We'll, we'll just roll it. And, of course, he does come with a power disc, but we'll fight some enemies. Actually, we'll put the power disc down and fight enemies with this on. So this is Finn's... Oh, we'll continue in the toy box. This is Finn's Stormtrooper costume. So he starts out as a Stormtrooper. Now we've got him in costume here, looking fine. Now, JV said that this increases the reload speed for this, but it's hard to tell. So he's, he's supposed to reload quicker. I don't think he does. But if he does, great. 
a very useful power disc, not just looks. And we got super jump, ground pound, hiya! Just overhead hammer there. And we'll drop in some uh, fellow stormtroopers. Well, we don't have any first order ones yet. We haven't finished the place yet. But we've got some, whoops, they're spaceships. Of course I'm going to find them there. Uh, we've got some average Joe stormtroopers. We've got some long range fellows here. Oh, we can have, have sand troopers. I like these guys, the sand troopers. Drop a couple of these guys in here. Uh, they should be on extreme difficulty, so they won't die straight away. We'll pull up some combos against them. Unless I fail. It's just one. Then you wait. And then you do it again. Smack in the face. And do a finisher. There's our stun grenade. He just burnt up. He's roasted. Then we can just shoot him. Go to town with a gun here. It shoots so much. Obviously, if you're playing on the default difficulty setting, it'll be so much better. But we're just playing on extreme, just so they survive, so we could actually do that finisher. But we can drop it down now that we have successfully done it. And then we'll use our uh, our special attack. So we'll drop it down to medium. There we go. So if we do RB, Finn just stands there and shoots. Let's face him. So you'll burn through this really quickly, so you really gotta... I think you gotta buy some extra ones for this. Because you'll just burn through them. Especially when you're gonna shut a lot. But we can get our special meter back by killing people or destroying toys while aiming through the sights. Well, not the sights, but using left trigger to aim. We'll get back some of our special meter by taking our enemies this way. So let's watch. Let's, we got this guy on a little bit of health, but watch my special meter. It should go up. And we take this guy out. There we go. So it goes up a good chunk. I'm not sure if that's because of this speedy meter upgrade. But I think that would definitely help here. So let's use our special. We'll drop in two enemies. One enemy should top up our special. And then we'll do the special attack on the other enemy. It's very, uh... It's not a satisfying special. Is it? Oh, we got a one more. It takes a little bit. There we go. He bumped us up nice. And he gave us an extra one. So it takes a, it's not a very satisfying special because you can't really tell what's going on. But that might be because we were getting shot. So if we drop in something that won't shoot us. Do you shoot? I don't think you do. If you do, I'm not sure. I think you just physically attack us. So he appears. We do RB. Yeah, see, it's not that satisfying. It's, you may as well just do that. Honestly, you may as well just use a gun. So... I think this could be a special you could actually skip if you really wanted to. But there you go. That is more or less Finn in a nutshell. Or oh, we could do a combo breaker. Which I mean... Actually, we'll do two things. We'll drop in a frost giant. He's got physical attack. So we'll do his actual block breaker attack. Which is holding down Y or triangle or whatever it is on your console of choice. Oh yeah! And then you can go to town on the air. Actually, we'll do that. We'll do that. Buddy, 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 you gotta come up here with me. He's not being a champ, is he? And then we'll shoot him down. Oh, I failed. Oh, he died too soon. Uh, but there you go. Let's do a block. A well timed press of B, and then we'll follow it up with a counter attack if we can pull it off. I'm always the worst at these. Alright, big fella. I need you to punch me. Punch me. Come on, buddy. Punch me. I'm always the worst timing with this. Counter attack! There we go! <laughs> he exploded like crazy. Uh, but there's Finn. I hope you enjoyed this video. This look at Finn in the Force Awakens characters for Disney Infinity 3.0. If you did, leave a like and of course subscribe for more Disney Infinity 3.0. Butch as well. Good old Rancher Butch here. Drop him in. He is enormous! See what I mean? These aren't like some slapped together mini version of these dinosaurs. These are the legit full-on size. It is so awesome. Butch